Hey, what's up everybody? Quick video if you're interested in concealing your circuit breaker box in your home. Uh, this video hopefully can help you out. Uh, ours was installed in a very common area of our basement and you can see what I essentially did is convert it to a little dress up corner for my kids. So I put a mirror over the actual circuit breaker box. So let's get a closer look here. All right, I got a little latch system. I'll put a link in the description below if you're interested in that latch. I looked everywhere for a latch that would do just the trick, that would that would be secure enough to hold it down. Obviously, you're going to want to make sure that your breaker box door opens freely if you do install the mirror. You don't want it to encumber the opening of that breaker box door in any way. Um, also, I went to the hardware store and picked up some uh, utility hinges, two of them you can see in the video, because and I wanted to make sure, obviously, that there would be enough clearance, so I had to put a little piece of wood behind the utility hinge to build that out just a little bit so that when the mirror closed, the electrical breaker box surface would not actually touch the back of the mirror. Here's a look at that little latch, a little closer up. It's a two-piece latch. There's a better look as well. So pretty simple job. Uh, you just want to make sure your measurements obviously are spot on. So measure twice or three times and drill once, right? And I drilled directly into the stud since this mirror was pretty heavy. Again, you can see that gap there building out a little bit because the breaker box does extend out a slight bit. So count on doing that. So that's it. Hopefully this video has been helpful. If it has, do me a favor and click the subscribe button. Thank you so much.